to the 2024 planner setup. We're gonna jump right in. We have a lot to go over. I have a huge cut on my hand, so that's why I'm covering it up. I believe this is gonna be loosely edited because we really have a lot to go over. I'm only going to be doing one month at a time. That is the first change. So I just wanted to let you know that now. We're gonna clear everything out. And if you've already seen the planner supplies, then you know that I talked about already having one of the uh, cards, one of the journaling cards, and here it is. It's in here. I don't really even remember it half the time because I haven't really been planning all that much. That is my own fault. So this is what we have. I thought about cleaning this out, but let's be honest. Again, I haven't really been doing the plans. So there's really nothing to clean actually. So we have the same exact, okay, we could take that off. We have the same exact dividers um, that I've had since the beginning of my A5 rings journey. And they're from cloth and paper, just like my planner, actually. So I'm just adding these back into the fold. I love my touch and nose kind of thing. Love that. Uh, let's see what else I have going on here. This is going to go... Don't know if we're going to keep that. Um... We're gonna move some things around, see what's gonna work moving forward, but we know that these are the dividers that we're working with. We're gonna have our January, January, which looks very odd right in front of schedule because uh, I don't like it like this. It's important to change your planning when your life is also changing because honestly, if the planning is not being effective the way that you're doing it, it's probably, probably, I can't speak for everyone, it's probably not working because you no longer live the way you did when the planning was effective. So maybe you need to switch it up and that's where I am right now. So I'm gonna do one month, my other dividers, I have schedule, lists, projects, finances, goals, ideas, and miscellaneous. So that's what I have here. I'm just gonna throw these in so I don't lose track of what is going where. Um, I still love this, I still love it. The problem is that this oldie but a goodie rubbed off on this. This was a clearance last call item and the color is not doing it justice. This is actually more on the uh, what do you want to call it? Butterscotch side. It's more golden than it is this lime green color that it's coming off as. So that's something. Uh, let's see what else. I need to update this. This is my cycle tracking in case you wanted to be in my business that much. What else do we have here? I still love what I've done with the place. This is a layered effect, uh, cloth and paper on top. And I believe, yeah, 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 that's cloth and paper as well. I don't think this is in stock either. It's a play on like paint. And I do love this. This is actually from Sesame. Yeah. Definitely a keeper. Notice how this says August. Like, can we just, please. I'm not even gonna take you through what is in here because honestly, where were the plans? You see this, this says September 25th and nothing happened. What a waste of an insert. One thing I will say, if nothing else, I'm gonna waste an insert. That is just, at this point, I'm just supporting the businesses. I'm not even, doing the plans. What a joke. What a joke. What a joke. This is October. You didn't get any plans for October. You can see that I didn't make any. I just went on my trip and enjoyed my time. That was pretty much it. I have, of course, you know I love my sticky notes. So those are going to follow suit. And... 
what else okay so these dividers these are gonna go into let me show you my clear my clear one here and it has old inserts and stuff that I I've, I've kept so that's what's in there nothing too special quotes that I've enjoyed oh gosh I'm getting annoyed I'm gonna have to go back into this in a moment but I'll explain why in just a okay I need to move that where's my inbox my inbox is in look at this beautiful insert we'll talk about this too in a moment okay all that is out all that is out Look at my dusty inbox. And I'm gonna be honest, I'm not in the mood right now to clean it. I'm motivated to get my planner set up and I'll do any kind of anything else I need to do later. Um, I don't think, we'll come back to that. We'll come back to additions. We just need the, the meat and potatoes right now. And to be honest, I want to get rid of all of these, actually, because what even is this? What even happened here? Like, what was the point of me doing that? If you've seen my quarterly reading wrap ups, they were going well until you let your friends borrow your books and you're just waiting for them to return them so you can make your little videos and then you end up just change your mind not even making them but I want my books back so I'm gonna let her have her little birthday week and then I'm going to be serious about getting my books back anyway so savings challenge never got finished I might as well just work on that again expense tracker that I did not use savings goals that I want to use how many do I have? Like three? And then I gotta go harass Cecil B for some more? Sure. Okay, we're gonna mimic after that. Um, okay. This is all going away. Some of the things you might see me move them around uh, in the January plan with me, just while I get familiar with how it looks for a little bit and then of course we'll finalize it but for the meat and potatoes this is what we got I don't think there is a need to change this I think this is a beautiful layout it's not aggravating me it's not getting on my last nerve like I thought it would with the moving around of things it's fine now in the making of this video I realized something about the monthly overviews We'll talk about it in the January plan with me. Oh, look how beautiful. Black and white together, just beautiful. Anyway, if you saw the planner supplies video, you know that I placed an order with the yearly monthly overviews, if you will. I placed this order first and then I had a moment of planner reflection and realized I need to go back to Vertical Weekly. The running argument between Monday start, Sunday start, my monthly is always going to be a Sunday start. My weekly will always be a Monday start. So that is the difference between the two, aside from the fact that this is only the monthly calendars and this one is every single week. Now, what I am going to do is just pull out January for from both packets and only use the... Uh, initial pages from this one. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the ones in here, but we're gonna work off of this mainly. I'm gonna cut out all this noise making. You don't need it. Okay, I do love this. Do I love it enough to put it in the front? I think if my planner was a different color, I would, but since it isn't, it's beautiful but I think I might use it for the separation between January and my other dividers. 
Uh, I think it, it would be more effective there. And I believe I'm going to go back to my velvet in the front after I clear it out, of course. These are the only Mademoiselle dots that I have left. So for my cycle tracking, I might just go Ibiza. I might just do that. On the back, this is how behind the times. Like this is my old reading list. Definitely got past 18. So there's that. Um, end of quarter checklist, that's Q1 of 2023. And we're talking Q1 2024, very ridiculous actually. Cute little sweet caress designs and papery planning. I'm gonna work my way through these in the next two months. So I'm gonna leave these in here. Definitely gonna keep these in here. Look, I've had this so long, babe, it's time to replace it, but I'm not gonna do it yet. You can't make me. You can't make me. January. I am only keeping this in here because I thought I had my January monthly cover readily available, but I'm finding May through December. So where is everything else? So I have to find that before the January plan with me. So until then, ooh, let's do, for now, let's just put this one back here because what I'm thinking, hear me out. This, no, I, ooh, I don't know who, I don't know which one of you, but whoever did it, whoever went in that meeting and said, this is going to be the wave, this is going to be the thing, you shouldn't have done it. You shouldn't have went in there and said that because this, I just don't understand. And I've tried to understand. I opened up my package. I tried to receive it. I recited it. I sat with it. And I still don't understand why. Now, if these were given to us for each month so that we can layer it, so that we can, you know, do all of that, I feel like throw five of them in the back of the package. I... I am not into it. I tried. I'm just going to put my inbox over it and it's just going to be like, mm, okay, okay. I might slap some, like, what What can I do? What can I do? Ta-da. Like, I'm not into it. <laughs> we'll work with it, though. This is what we have. We are going to be adaptable to our environment. I'm just slapping some things on here for the time being only because... Only because this is not permanent, but this is just to see how we're feeling about this new piece of paper they gave us. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, let's see. What's it looking like back here? This, guys, <laughs> CMP. Who said yes to that? Ooh, just, just say their names say their names or leave it on the playground because that is not no no okay so this is the one it's a little light it's a little bit light but this is the monthly from the yearly package i'm going to put these in finance and i know that's gonna bother a lot of people the opening and closing of the rings but just bear with me in my time of need okay i'm gonna put this here and hear me out i have a few giving things saving things and i believe that this might just might make sense moving forward on a monthly basis i think that this is also going to kind of push me to go into my finance section more. And we're gonna hope for the best on that one. Now this, I love this, I love this. So where do we put it? Where do you think we should put it? Back in the front? I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't like a flat planner, babe. 
oh i don't like a flat planner i might need to add a couple more months it's just too flat for me it's just a little bit too flat we might have to add february and march because i it, it's feeling like a trapper keeper from sixth grade and i don't like that feeling i need a little bit more foundation under here when i'm writing i don't think i like that and granted we do have more to add, so let's just keep going. You know, task planner inserts are the fave, and they're gonna go in the list section. So, I mean, we're getting there, but we're still not there. Uh, we are going to remake this in another video. We're gonna remake the weekly. So this video is getting to be really long. And I know that some of you enjoy my chaotic madness, <laughs> foolishness, but do I want to torture you like this? No, I don't. Where are you going? Where are you going? I haven't updated this in a while actually. That needs a refresh as well. Another up, I need to update this. Um, because one of these, obviously, I have visited. If you are a couple videos behind, I can never keep my bar cart stock because I'm always making something. Okay. Okay, things have happened off camera because I had to move stuff around. I decided to go ahead and add February and March just so that I have a little bit more support when I'm writing. I find it to be a little bit more pleasing that way than being on, I might as well write on the table, you know what I mean? But anyway, so it just feels better knowing that it's a little bit thicker. I added another packet of task planner inserts because I will be using those later on. I do still love this and I love these stickies that I got from Mochi Things, but these were the first books I read for 2023. And now it's time to accept that we are very much so into 2024 and I need to switch that. Um, for now, this is okay. Let's start from the beginning. I'm gonna have to figure this out because these can't be flopping all over the place. They can't be. So I might have to put a clip or a pin here. Look out for the January plan with me to see what I end up doing. If you hear me sounding distant, I'm looking behind me to see if I have anything in close proximity where I can just reach out and grab it, but I can't. Uh, so this is what we have. Let me move this down. Let me get some more of these. Bring them back. Even if you print them accidentally, I'll take them. And then, you know, we have my Sweet Caress collection over here. I love this image, so it stays. I never write on this. I probably should. This is still going to be my cycle tracking. Uh, holidays, I'm going to be honest, I literally never look at this and I should. That'll be time off of my phone if I just use my planner. Love this layering effect. I literally don't use it for anything just to look at. I'm proud of it. <laughs> And then we're into January, not much going on here yet. What I will put here is my Habit Tracker sticky note. I will have the stickies like this, just to give you like a little insight. Whatever books that I read in January, I'll have the stickies here, because for those that maybe aren't into my book related things, but you do kind of want a more cohesive, plan with me you'll at least know that i read some things and these were my rapid fire thoughts so i'll add those on this side here we have my clear inbox i just threw some transparent circles and some sticky notes here just for the time being when we get into the january plan with me we'll really get into it you already know how i feel about this i'm not going to talk about it i just mm -mm. anyway so we have january we've already talked about this in the planner supplies now it is quite faint i will say that but i do enjoy the space that we've been given for the overview of 
of the month before we had important dates we had notes and all of that going on at the bottom but now we have ample amount of space to write in bills if that's what you use it for youtube video scheduling appointments you have enough space to really put multiple things on each day and for those that use the mini stickers like these now what i noticed when i used these they would just take up so much space but in the older layout i would use these and they were perfect so this was a custom that i chose mini and then this one is the standard size so that i don't know why that one is upside down like are you okay okay now i can go back to using these but will i i don't know I really do like these being smaller. I have some dollar signs here that want to escape just like out of my account. And I also have the petite dots in oatmeal which are very cute and adorable and love those as well. So that's what we have for that. Lots of notes. What am I supposed to write in this? I don't know. Lots of notes. But here we have what I've been waiting on. This is the Vertical Weekly. I'm pretty excited about going back to a Vertical Weekly and it has been a while, probably since the very beginning of my rings journey. So we'll see how it goes. I do have some pre-planning stuff that I already have written out. So I'll just be transferring it over to the week. I did um, also use my A5 schedule notepad for the workday today. And I'll also hole punch that and add it in to the back of the month back here just so that I can document how the day went. And it will also help me with my workday in terms of progress. I also thought that maybe, just maybe, for the overview of the month, because I never really know how to use the side or in, I never really enjoy using the side but I also don't want to waste the space either so I'm thinking you see you see what I'm thinking you see where my head is you see what I think it could work I think it might add a little flair what are your thoughts I don't know let me know but that's what I'm thinking for that schedule cleaning routine which by the way um, if you are curious about what I'm supposed to be doing today I am actually going to be doing bathrooms and kitchen and dining if that tells you anything and I need to update travel which you already saw and we might have a day where we just really get into these different sections a little bit better and revamp update refresh what they are because some of them I really don't pay attention to to be honest and this is where I put all of the extra pages that I'm not using yet, but they will also go into places like this, projects. And in finance, this was for the savings. But again, when we talk about the finances, you'll see what I put in here. So I did end up adding February and March. I find that I'll just keep it quarterly for now. And we'll also update the goals and ideas section as well. So that is pretty much the setup, the rough draft, if you will. For 2024, I'm keeping it simple, keeping it pretty basic. I'm keeping it minimal so that I can spend more time planning instead of being cute. And for now, I, I'm enjoying the refresh. It was needed. And I will see you in the January plan with me, 2024. Please be kind. Please come with more money. Please come with more peace. Bye.